Hi guys, this is Margo J. Rathbun and I hope you're doing well. You can see here from the scene in this video behind me that we're in a different location than what I usually film uh, in for my other videos. And that's because we're at home. This is my kitchen behind me. And I guess this is the, the dining room, you could call it here, that I'm sitting in. And uh, the reason that I'm here today is I'm excited to tell you that we are gonna start making more informal videos, more personal videos where I can interact with you one-on-one. -on -one, and I'm gonna share with you some of the personal nutrition tips and little health tidbits that I use on a daily basis in my own life. And uh, this is going to give me a chance to answer any questions that you guys may have. And you can send me your questions to margo at AuthenticSelfWellness.com. If you're a fan on Facebook, uh, be sure to private message me your questions. And you can find me on Facebook under Authentic Self Wellness. You can also leave your questions below in uh, the comment section here on YouTube if it's a question that you don't mind asking publicly because obviously everybody can read it. So it's really up to you. So today, I wanna answer the question that I get over and over and over again. And that is, what do you eat on a daily basis? And as a nutritional therapy practitioner, and specifically just for me, I can tell you that I eat a lot. And if we were to go through all the different foods that I eat on a weekly basis, we would be here probably for two hours and you guys would fall asleep. So what I thought I would do is take you along with me on a little food shopping trip that I did a couple days ago. And this wasn't like my big haul to the grocery store. This is more of a shopping trip that helped to uh, replenish the foods that I was running out of, just to kind of stock up on some fun things. And honestly, I love just going to the grocery store. It's a lot of fun for me. I get excited about different products and different foods. So uh, let's take a look at some of the things I got and let's talk about the health benefits and how you can use them in your personal diet. So first of all, I picked up this gorgeous bag of organic lemons. Now lemons are an absolute must here in my household. I add lemons to my water first thing in the morning every day because lemons are a great uh, source of immune boosting vitamin C. And when you add lemon juice to your water, it helps to alkalinize your system. And I swear by my lemon water first thing in the morning. I have my big mason jar that I drink, I squeeze some in, and I notice a lift of energy within five minutes of me drinking this mixture. So I highly recommend that you always have organic lemons on hand. Really delicious too. Kind of keeping in line with the produce theme that we have going here, I picked up these donut peaches and you can kind of see um, they're just so cute. I couldn't resist. They're fuzzy. They're uh, not super firm to touch. They've got a little bit of a bounce back which tells you that they're ripe and you always want to purchase ripe peaches because that means that they have the most nutrients, uh, they're juicy, and they're also going to be the most delicious. Now I love peaches, not only because they're in season right now, but because they're a great source of fiber. And I'm always looking to add fiber to my diet in creative ways, and peaches are a great way to do this. I might just snack on these plain, I actually might make a smoothie or two of them because I love the juiciness of peaches in uh, the smoothie beverages. And you can also cut them up into little uh, pieces and drizzle some raw honey on the top. It's a really great dessert alternative. You guys uh, definitely check that out. One of my favorite things that I always pick up when I go to New Seasons are these coconut macaroons. Now you're like, okay, desserts, cookies, really, Margo, really? Well, Jenny's coconut macaroons are one of my favorites because I think of them as more of an energy bar, I guess you could say, like an energy snack. They're sulfite free, they're lactose free, they're soy free, wheat free, gluten free, dairy free, yeast free, all natural. Loaded with great ingredients that help to promote a natural lift of energy. I'll show you guys what they look like. Um, I usually just pop one in my mouth, I would say once or twice a day, they're just like little bite sized coconut macaroons, if you guys can see those. Really chewy, really delicious. I like soft cookies, um, if you can again call them cookies, just because easier to chew and encourages that saliva production to promote good digestion and they're just really delicious. So make sure that you stock up on these. Again, if you don't have a new seasons in your area, you can check them out on their website or go to their Facebook page under Jenny's Coconut Macaroons 
and take a look to see if they're available in your area. My favorite crackers are Mary's Gone Crackers. This is uh, organic, wheat-free, gluten-free. This is the black pepper flavor. This is my favorite because I like to dip it in hummus. And I recommend these crackers because they contain authentic ingredients like ground rice, they have quinoa, they have flax seeds, they have sesame seeds. Really delicious, um, always a staple here in my kitchen when I'm in the mood for something crunchy to snack on. Um, really highly recommend this product. Check it out again on Facebook, go to their website and see if they are available in your area. I was intrigued by these guys. I didn't really need them, but it was a new product that I hadn't seen, so I wanted to pick it up. These are from Garden Bar, and I picked up the Indian uh, Savory Bar and the Japanese Savory Bar. Now, I'm a label freak, like I always spend tons of time looking at the labels, especially on snack bars, because I'm very holistic and I don't like to eat anything that has any unnatural additives to it. I like these because they have ingredients like uh, peas, bell peppers, cabbage, shiitake mushrooms, and I haven't tried these yet so I don't know how they taste. I will give it a try and let you guys know, but uh, definitely interesting. So check out Garden Bar and tell me what you think if you pick these up too. We'll kind of collaborate and see what our thoughts are as far as taste goes. Another fun bar that I picked up was from Greens Plus. It's their Chia Omega Bar. I can't resist anything that has chia in it. Chia seeds are so amazing. Great source of omega-3 fatty acids, of fiber, antioxidants, just a really good food to add to your diet on a daily basis. And I like these because it's portable, you can take it with you, especially during these summer months when a lot of us are active. You can even take it with you to work, leave it in your desk drawer so you have a nice pick-me-up snack uh, when you get that midday hump around 2 or 3 in the afternoon. So definitely check out uh, the, chia, the uh, chia bars from Green Plus. I was in the mood for some chili this week, so I went ahead and I picked up my Simply Organic go-to spice packs here. Love these, and it's USDA organic, which is important. And I've got the spicy chili seasoning here. Really good, I love spicy foods. In fact, I'll probably even add more spice to it than recommended because I just love hot food. Bring the heat. And then they've also got a great vegetarian chili uh, spice that you can add as well. And this pairs really nicely with a bunch of different beans, vegetables. I really recommend that if you're looking for spices that you check this out. So this is our first informal casual video. Again, if you have any questions, be sure to send me an email to margo at authenticselfwellness.com. You can also private message me through my Facebook page under Authentic Self Wellness. And as always, thank you for watching. Have a happy and a healthy day.